As we are learning more information about a mass shooting in a Memphis suburb tonight. It happened at a Kroger grocery store in Collierville. Officials are calling it the most horrific event in that town's history. Collierville police say 13 people were shot, one person was killed. The suspected shooter is also dead, possibly from a self-inflicted gunshot. Right now, the suspect's vehicle is being investigated. Our sister station, WREG, says the suspect was a subcontractor who worked in the store's deli department. Collierville police arrived around 1.30 this afternoon, their time, and found multiple police, uh, people shot and employees hiding in several areas. Now, witnesses report hearing at least a dozen shots fired. A Mid-South man pulled out his cell phone during the chaos as a man on the roof of the Kroger tried to tell police where the shooter was. Jason Lusk shared this video with us. It shows a man with his arms up trying to help police find the suspect. He starts pointing down the parking lot as officers armed with guns move closer to the scene. Lusk says he got down when he heard gunfire. I crawled around to the passenger seat of my vehicle, opened it to the passenger door, opened it, and got my phone out and was able to catch um, some of the shots on video and then um, the police arriving. I, I stopped videoing at some points because I was in fear for my life. Collierville store will remain closed until further notice. Kroger released a statement on the shooting saying we are deeply saddened by the incident that occurred at our Kroger store in Collierville, Tennessee. The entire Kroger family offers our thoughts, prayers, and support to the individuals and families of the victims during this difficult time. We are cooperating with local law enforcement and we have initiated counseling services for our associates. To protect the integrity of the ongoing investigation, we are referring questions to the Collierville Police Department. We will continue to follow the story as it develops for you.